Hello friends, those who have been preparing for Accenture off campus or on campus 2023 exam, today's video will obviously help them because we have been observing that TC in TCS and QT, there are lots of questions that are being asked repeatedly. So we have been solving all slot questions uh, being asked in Accenture off campus 2023. So today we are going to solve slot 4 question that was modified array. Uh, before solving this, uh, before uh, reading this question, I will request you to watch full playlist uh, which is given in the description box uh, which will obviously help you to get the point uh, which is uh, being actually uh, familiar with the questions. So let's read the question. The function accepts an integer array error of size m rearrange the given array in such a way that smallest element of array is the first element of array and second element is the largest element of array Se second smallest element of array is the third element of array second largest element of array is the fourth element of the array in such a manner if the size is started bigger than bigger then this uh, frequency will start continuing so uh, and here it is mentioning the return null if array is empty here are a sample input uh, that is the array will look like 5 2 3 4 6 5 minus 2 and the output will be minus 2 6 2 5 3 5 4 uh, I am explaining how it is actually uh, uh, answered. Actually, we uh, have to sort them first. If you sort uh, in numerical manner, numerical order, then it will be minus 2, 2, 3, and 4, 5, 5, and 6. So, if you ar arrange the array in ascending order then uh, we will observe that um, this value is the smallest value and this value is the highest largest value so it is mentioned that the smallest element of the array will be the first element of the output and the second element of the array will be the largest element of the array in this way the third element will be the smallest uh, second smallest and the fourth element will be uh, second largest and this way we will continue the process the frequency we will be continued okay so without expanding any more patch patch we will actually start solving the problem uh, before solving the question i will be i will request you to subscribe my channel or i will request you to solve the problem by yourself. and uh, then we will what it was mentioned that uh, return null if array is empty but uh, we have we have taken this is as void will not return anything we will actually print uh, directly here but you will uh, you, you can do it by int uh, it is your duty to fulfill the criteria okay i am just giving you the logic fully so
so uh, the answer is actually matching minus two six two five three five four so in this way you can uh, take many other inputs and that will actually solve the problem so i hope you have learned a little bit from me i request you to have a eagle eye on my channel thank you Thank you.